right so in this video we are going to go through the process of doing a quotation uh, in quickbooks so to do a quotation you can just click here under estimates and then uh, first you need to make sure that you are using a template that is not written estimate here uh, we'll do a video how to customize this template but for now you can just continue with this one so you come here and select the customer name if the customer is already in the system you can select but if the customer is not in the system you need to search for the customer let's say your customer name is showline let's say your customer name is showline erp then you click enter then the system is now telling you uh, this customer is not in the system and is also asking you to select the current that you want to use so i want to use zwo for this customer and then i can want to click on setup so that i can put all the other details so you click there and then i enter the number house number address not house number the address for this customer uh, pattern, pattern waterfalls then i click on copy there you just click ok ok again then you click ok again here uh, you click tab key tab key tab key up until you come here now you select the item that you want to quote the customer for come here again you select that quantity let's say is three so in the rate that we are using it's 0 0.01 uh we have done a video on how to change this exchange rate so you can come here and click on preview so here how is the this is how the the quotation will be looking like however it can be customized we put our logo there and everything that we want it to appear like then you click on close then here click on save and close so that's it for doing quotations uh we can also convert this quotation to a sales invoice they say the customer comes and now says you want to make a you want to you want us to do a sales invoice so we can move from here to here and then from here and then to receiving payment so let me just click here uh so you can select the name of the customer i select show like erp there uh so it's showing us this is the active estimates for this one so i click here on this one and then i choose the one that i want so you double click on it uh, you click on continue editing then here you know uh it's still letting i know let me go back again double click there double click here again uh then you click save changes uh, okay let me go back again double click there discard changes so you need to click on discard changes then you click on create invoice the entire estimate has been copied uh, so you can click ok here right so it's now here uh, so if you want to do any changes to the quotation maybe they are just here now they say they want two instead of quoted three you can also do that maybe they have negotiated for a price increase or the price have increased to five to thirty five thousand you can also do that from here then you click on preview so this is how it would look like it's now it's now an invoice you click on save and close and here it's also showing you all the transaction that you've done with this client so here i can click on save and close uh here you can click don't show again uh let me go back to home so that's it that's how you do your quotations in in quickbooks